calculate months between two dates in Google Sheets. Using start date and end date, we are going to show you how to calculate the number of completed years, completed months, and completed days in Google Sheet itself. So here, as you can see, we have uh, some of the data, which is the start date and the end date. And we have three uh, columns over here, completed years, completed months and completed days. So we are going to show you a simple hack that you can use to uh, calculate completed years, months and days. So for year, you can uh, write this formula that can help you to quickly calculate the number of years between the start and the end date. And the formula is kind of same for months and days as well. So here write date, diff, diff stands for difference, the start date, a cell which is B4 and the end date cell which is C4. So write the formula the way we are writing it and then in inverted commas write Y which stands for EO and then the close bracket. So you get the answer like this and you can simply select and drag it across the cells uh, for which you want the number of total years. So how simple is that? Repeat the same for months but there will be a slight change in it. For months you will write date difference in bracket you will write the start date which is the start date cell which is B4 the end date cell which is C4 and in inverted commas you will write M in inverted commas you will write M which stands for months so here it is you have gotten the total number of months between the start and the end date you can select and drag it across the cells and calculate what the rest of the sheet now we are going to look at the uh, formula for counting days for days you have to write date difference B4 as it is a start date, C4 cell as it is the end date and then in inverted commas write D. Now D stands for days and uh, this is the formula. So you saw that here we got 366 and you can now drag it across the sheet and find the number of days for the rest of the dates. How simple is that right? Try out this formula in your Google Sheets and make your life more easier. For more such videos subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.